What is happening guys? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You got Brody here and today we are going to be opening three absolute football blaster boxes. Now we have opened the 2022 on this channel before. If you want to go watch that, go back out there. But I ordered these on Target. They finally came in. I thought no better way uh, to test out some new things. You might be seeing, hey, the lighting looks, the lighting looks a little bit different in there. Um, we're working on some stuff. I've got two big lights here that we just added. Uh, I got light overhead. So I'm hoping that kind of removes the glare. I also want to show you guys too something. I don't pull a lot of cards off camera, but we did pull this three of five Forrest Griffin auto. Now you might be able to see me here. Let me see. Where am I? Maybe kind of see me you can see the camera there i am there i'm waving uh any advice on how to remove that it doesn't you you can kind of see my camera set up there you go you can see my arm and my shirt and all that stuff any advice on how to remove that glare i'm not sure maybe i need to have a light behind shooting to remove that but uh it is what it is i don't open a lot of packs off camera but I posted on our Instagram, which is over a thousand followers by now. So thank you to everyone that has followed us on Instagram. If you guys wanted to see more UFC opens and it's close to 50, 50. So that's why I was like, ah, maybe I'll just open these UFC packs off camera. Um, but if that's something that maybe you guys want, to, I don't know. You guys let me know in the comments. It seemed, it seemed like it was pretty, pretty obvious that the majority of people it's like 60 40 said no i think so i don't know if we'll do ufc we might just stick to football basketball baseball maybe a little hockey maybe i'll sprinkle it in there every once in a while but i am excited about this the kaboom hunting we're testing the lights kelsey isn't here with us today i just want to do a quick video apologies but we're going to be doing kaboom hunting and seeing uh what this is all about here so 66 cards per box there's going to be 11 cards uh, per pack, six packs per box, and um, we're going to look for autographs, mem cards, which is pretty cool. I like having the ability of hitting autographs out of a blaster, and also we're going to be getting three green parallels um, on average, but we're really looking for the ultra rare kabooms and explosives, but the the um, kabooms are obviously the ones that we're after. Okay, here's some other stuff that we can go after on here. It's only a 200 card set, which is kind of, you know, we're going to see a lot of the same players. Only 100 base, 100 rookies. So still a lot of rookies, but the base is much, much sm smaller here. You can get uh, base red squares, orange mosaic, blue diamonds, green waves, gold stars, purple rain, black galaxy. So you can get numbered cards all the way from 499 to 1. Those are the base signatures as well. They've got some pretty cool inserts in here. I've watched some videos. I like the by storm a lot. Draft is a really cool one where it shows you actually where the, you know, what round or what pick the person was drafted, I think, in what year. I think that's a really cool insert. And then Rock Out is another cool insert. And then these are the big ones, right? The Kaboom Horizontal and the Explosive. That is what you're looking for. So without further ado, Let's uh, let's go fire away and um, see. Hopefully this looks a lot better for you. Like I said, we're trying, we're just starting off, so we're trying to, you know, make everything improve, you know, improve everything as we go. And uh, one of those things, I'm actually gonna unplug this because this is in my way. One of those things is the lighting situation. So hopefully this takes away the major glare. I don't know how to get rid of the reflection. So if you see me in the back freaking out from a crazy pole, apologies, but it is what it is. Well, that's okay. Thin, thin packs. All right, this is my first look at the 2023 Absolute Football. And I gotta tell you, I actually kind of like this design. It gives me a little bit of a mixture of Prestige and Don Russ vibes. And I actually like it. It's pretty uh, pretty simple. Let me, I'm, I'm all out of whack that Kelsey isn't here. Let me get into position here. All right, we are in position. Um, and we're going to see if we can get a case hit. We're going to see if we can get a kaboom. So let's start off. Javante Williams. We'll also see. We'll kind of go slow through the first box because there are going to be some players on here I haven't seen before. Lamar Jackson. Cooper Cup. 
Do we want to talk about Lamar Jackson real quick? Boy. He's in a position right now where mentally, holy cow, it is going to be hard to get out of that. Because I know going into that game, Davis Mills, there's our favorite player, he was probably thinking, okay, everyone thinks I can't win the big game. Everyone thinks I can't win the big game. And then look what ends up happening. So Stefan Diggs here, and then we're going to get to our rookies. So you get a couple base cards to start, and then you get, I believe, three rookies, and then there should be one or two cards after that. So our first rookie is going to be Emmanuel Forbes. And then we have, see, like this is a new one. I've never seen this rookie before. I got to tell you guys, the lighting looks way better. Please tell me this looks way better than what we've been doing. The lighting on my face and the lighting on the cards. I'm just looking through the camera right now. It looks incredible. There we go. Our first Raider, Trey Tucker. And we got one card behind. And this is the introductions. So this is going to be, who the flip is that? Is that Jordan Addison? Where is the name? Yeah, that is Jordan Addison. He's throwing a pass, though. <laughs> Jordan Addison, the, uh, the football, the quarterback recruit here. So I don't know. Um, I watched one video and the guy was talking about how I can't remember. I would I would have shouted him out. I can't remember what it was. It just popped up on one of my um, for you videos, and the guy was kind of talking about how that car just feels like it doesn't belong. Um, this feels a little thicker, and I gotta agree with you. It, it I love the look of these cards, but then you get to that insert and it just doesn't really feel like it's a part of the set. Michael Pittman, I don't know why I'm putting these here. All right, we got Brees Hall, Christian Watson, Isaiah Pacheco. There's a Joe Burrow. And then we have, ooh, another new rookie here, Mackay Blackman. Kelsey's not here to correct me, so I'm just going to go for it. Then we have Daniel Wright. A lot of, lot of offensive linemen here. Back-to-back -back offensive linemen with Steve Av Avila. So really uh, talk about... Respect the rookies. Talk about respect the uh, offensive linemen. All right, our first green parallel, and you can kind of see the only difference here, the border doesn't change. It's literally just going to be the name, the team name, and then up here, absolute football is going to be green. So that's going to be our first green parallel, which is going to be David Montgomery, who had a phenomenal game, just wasn't enough. And then we get our first insert here on Jam Jamal Williams on the rock out. I actually am a fan of this insert. I think this looks really cool. I am a fan. That I don't know who is all on this insert, but this is certainly a uh, that's certainly one of the cards that I will be chasing after once I kind of can see who is on that. It's it's similar to me to Heroes and Prestige. Heroes and Prestige is one of my favorite inserts. Probably do this to kind of give a little bit of idea. All right, Najee Harris, A.J. Brown, Justin Jefferson, Garden Minshew, Tyreek Hill, Andy Dalton, Christian Kirk. And our first rookie is going to be Bijan Robinson here. And then that's followed up by Marvin Mims, Garrett Williams, and our first stargazing, Josh Jacobs, stargazing. Okay, so I'm wondering if it's going to stay this way where it's like a double photo. One is a close-up, one is a little bit farther away picture, and the back's actually really cool on this card. I just am so happy I got these lights. I can't tell you guys. It was, I hate putting out product that I'm like not super happy about. And again, this video will probably go up before some of the other videos we, we have in the tank. So there will be some videos back of us filming, but we're getting close to getting completely caught up. But I was getting so annoyed with, with, the, um, with the quality. So I do apologize for that. All right, but hopefully, hopefully this is better and we're moving forward. The next thing is to increase uh, the camera over here. Right now I'm going off my laptop and then also maybe get a mic stand that's up top dropping down so it's not actually in frame. And we'll probably get our a camera in front. I think that will look better than looking off to the side. All right, Devontae Adams, Damian Pierce, Isaiah Hodgins, Miles Sanders, Stetson Bennett. Okay, our first rookie quarterback is Stetson Bennett, Dylan Horton, and a Jaden Reed. Okay. And then we have our, our first green parallel rookie is going to be Deuce Vaughn. Nice. And then a kid reporter. 
Okay, two packs left in this blaster. Now, these were $25 off of Target's website, which I'm okay with blasting a couple of those out and just seeing how they are. I did I did ask people their their thoughts on the hobby box cuz we want to open everything here, not just retail. We also want to open hobby boxes on here too cuz we want to give a good look at like what is there what's out there to offer. However, we're still in the growing stages. All right, we got our rookies here. So, we can't we got to be smart. And we can't just afford to buy everything even though we have bought a lot. We can't afford to just buy everything. And so right now, I reached out, people are saying that price point, it was like what, $715 or something for the hobby. People are saying totally not worth it. Um, you would have to hit like a handful of cards to even make that box back. So we passed on it. But in the future, we definitely wanna try to get every format of, um, of a new product coming out. And, um, I just thought that was the smart decision is passing on that. People are telling me it's way too expensive. All right, we got our first Puka. We're gonna probably sleeve this. And then we have a Baker Mayfield on the green. And, oh yes. Okay, Stefan Diggs, very cool. Draft Diamonds, what do you guys think? I think this is a sick card. He was drafted in 2015 by the Vikings. They put you also in your drafted Jersey, which I the team that drafted his jersey, which I think is cool, and it's pick 146. I bet the Brock Purdy, if they have one of these, I bet that goes for a pretty penny. Um, seeing how he was the last draft and back to back Super Bowls, man, after being the, the last pick and your back to back Super Bowls, look at that. Okay, I'm very happy. I, I did not test that, and now I've tested it. I like the look of that. We would put cards back here and the, I mean, it might as well not even put cards back there because you could not see it because of the glare. So I like that a lot. That looks way better. All right, last pack on the first blaster. Honestly, not too, uh, not such a, uh, speak of the devil, Brock Purdy. Not that much great stuff so far, but I do like the look of the cards and going into this, you know, I'm not going into this naive. I'm going into this with the idea that it really is a kaboom or bust type of product. There aren't that many cards that hold their value over time from what people have been telling me. And that's okay. As long as you go into it knowing, all right, Jory Porter, that's probably our next best rookie or one of the best. Oh, and we get our first storm. This is, okay, I like this a lot. I also like to that they actually have the rookie badges on the inserts here. Some of the other products we've been opening, they actually don't have the rookie badges on there. So we have a Dalton Kincaid on the Buy Storm. Very cool. I wonder what the back says. He's awesome, he can separate, he has great hands. Okay, so it just has like a, um, some sort of ana uh, analysis from someone on their thoughts on the person. All right, cool. All right, so that's the first blaster. Let me know what you guys think about Absolute. Is this a product that you look forward to ripping every year? Is this something that you're fine with kind of opening a couple times and, and then calling it? Is this something where you, you love the Kaboom Chase and you're just gonna buy a crazy amount of blasters? And I mean, I guess I'm assuming Mega Boxes come out of this product too. And, and chase those chase those kabooms, let me know. All right, we are on blaster number two. We'll fly through this one a little bit faster now that we kind of have a, an idea of what they look like. We might stop on a couple uh, new inserts. I think we've seen pretty much every insert though. Mike Evans, Jalen Hurts. Okay, our first rookie is gonna be Tyree Wilson. Another Joey Porter Jr. A Luke Schoonmaker. And then our, ooh, okay. We get a Jonathan Mingo on the introductions here. And he's, I guess he's looking at, is that his actual card? I don't think that's actually, it looks like it's someone, I don't, maybe that is his actual card. It's tough to tell. But there you go, introductions. I, I would have to agree with the person that I saw the video. I think that is going to be my least favorite insert out of uh, all of them so far. Okay, Kid Reporter on the back. 
Christian or yeah, Christian McCaffrey, he's an absolute monster. Had another major game. Okay, Herbert, Deshaun Watson, Debo Samuels, also a beast. Deontay Johnson, and then we get to our rookies here. Still have outside of Puka, we still haven't really seen any of the other big rookies here. Byron Young, we got another rookie quarterback here, and Jake Hayner. We have Miles Murphy. And then our first green is going to be Kenneth Walker the third, And then we get a rock out on Alexander Madison. Okay, he's not in a lot of sets. It's the first time I've pulled him before. Four packs left in this bloster. All right, let's fly through these here. Do, 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 do. Daniel Jones, Austin Eckler. Our first rookie is going to be Jonathan Mingo, Tyreek Stevenson, Tank Bigsby, and a stargazing of Juju Smith-Schuster. I wonder, how do you think they decide who gets a kaboom, who gets to go on these inserts? Is that something that the players have any, like, do they, the players have any sort of um, say in that? Or is that straight just Panini, just saying this is what we're doing. These are the people that are going on it. Look at this. Jake Moody, our first kicker. All right, respect the kickers, respect the rookies. Devin Witherspoon. And there we go, Anthony Richardson. All right, first. Oh, and oh, yes. Wow, what a pack. We get a green CJ Stroud. I did not look up any of the comps, so I'll throw that on the screen here as to what the comps are on these cards, but I don't care. First time opening, absolute, 2023, and we hit a green CJ Stroud. This would be, in my opinion, this would be the equivalent, sorry, I got this Corgi here that's just completely static to this top loader. Um, this would be equivalent to hitting, you know, CJ for, you know, we've opened a lot of Prism on here, that would be the equivalent of hitting CJ Stroud on, um, you know, one of the you know pink parallels or pulsars or something that you find in the prism blasters. Uh, as far as you know, there's only three per three per blaster. So, all right, there we go. Two of the big rookie quarterbacks in one pack. What would you know? Wow, that one pack was probably. I mean, we did get a Puka. But that one pack was probably more valuable than the entire last blaster. And that's just how crazy this rookie class is with these quarterbacks, man. I just saw our PSA 9. Our rating hasn't come back yet. That will be a video soon. But I just saw our CJ Stroud Prism Red Wave just sell PSA 9 for like $1,200. So, all right, Felix. There we go. Rasheed Rice. Very nice. He had another great game. Drew Sanders. This is a new rookie in this set. And then there you go. Potential. Uh, potential. I mean, he just broke Jerry Rice's uh, most receptions ever in, in the postseason, in the playoffs. So that's nuts. And then we get a Keenan Allen on the draft diamonds. So I like that. 2013 drafted by the Chargers. Pick number 76. Okay. Last pack in this blaster. And this, I would say this blaster is pretty good. Hit a couple big rookies so far. I haven't seen, I mean, I don't really know for, you know, numbered cards. We haven't seen any numbered cards yet. Obviously no autographs either so far. I'm assuming those are probably really hard to hit. We get a new rookie here. Jay Ward. Must be a defensive player. Dem uh, Demario Douglas. There we go. Michael Mayer, Raiders. And, ooh, Marvin Mims. I love this card. I really want this. And I really want a Stroud by Storm. This card is sick. I, I want a Stroud by Storm really bad. All right, last pack or excuse me, last box here. 
I have, uh, I think I have a couple more of these, but since I'm opening this without Kelsey, because I'm actually about to take a trip up to Lynchburg. If you, for those that don't know, I own a disc golf company that's out of Lynchburg, Virginia. And if you're a crazy football fan, then you'll know that's where Liberty University is. That's kind of, you know, when I say I went to University of Florida or, I mean, University of Florida, most people know what that school is, but that's in Gainesville, Florida. Liberty, Liberty University is where Lynchburg is, and uh, I'm heading up there to do some business stuff this week. So I wanted to get this video shot and out before I get back. But I know Kelsey was really excited to do kaboom hunting, so we will probably definitely get more of these, especially if they start hitting the shelves in stores. But I have yet to see them. I've only seen them online. All right, last box. Let's see if we can get some big rookies. DJ Turner, Michael Wilson, another Puka. We will love that. And a Nick Bosa, How State Boy. All right, Stargazing, How State Boy. Let's go. That's a cool card. I like the Stargazing one as well. I will right, we'll sleeve up our Puka here. Probably should top load Puka too. Kind of disrespectful to top load Anthony Richardson and CJ Stroud and not Puka, but hopefully he understands. My favorite guy, Davis Mills. Absolutely love this guy. Uh, do we see? No. Huh? No. I don't. Uh, there might. There might be something here. We might. We might have a. Is that a backwards card? We might have a backwards card here. We might have a backwards card here in the back. Tough to say. I, I Again, I'm not 100% familiar with this pack yet with the, these cards, but it looks like it goes, uh, chrome, it goes chrome, 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 and then white. And I think uh, there might be too many of there. I don't know. We'll see. We'll get there. Okay, here we go. Paris Johnson, Tyree Wilson, another Jory Porter. We'll save that one because I'm not sure. And we got, who we got here? We got Cooper Cup. Cooper Cup, 2017 Rams. Pick 69, wow. Jeez, he was, see that's also nice. All right, here we go. What do we got here? Do we got some backwards? Say Falcons? Oh, it's just a green. I'm an idiot. That's what the green looks like, that's right. The green, green is non-chrome Desmond Ritter, okay. The green is the non-chrome. All right. The backwards, yeah, the backwards doesn't have as many as that. All right, Dumbo. Dumbo moved by me. Apologies. You can put L in the chat if you want. I will take it. All right, let's fly. Let's fly. Justin Jefferson, Tyreek. We have a Luke Shoemaker, Byron Young. Jake Hayner, and, ooh, a Jordan Addison by Storm. All right, I'm collecting them all. I'm collecting all the by Storms. I love it. I love it a lot. We're down to our last three packs. This is, uh, I feel like I've opened enough now to where I have a good gauge on what I like and what I don't like. And I'm at the point at this product that I want to open more. Right. If you go back to the Goodwill Champions, which we have some of the boxes in the back, I, I was done opening that like after the second blaster. I did not want to open two more blasters. This product, I like looking at these cards. These cards look nice. I want to open more. So I am sad that we only have three packs left. But, ooh. Oh, no, they're just shiny on the light. Dang. Okay, I got to get used to this new light too. It's throwing me off. I think we have something back there and we don't. All right, Miles Murphy, Jonathan Mingo, Tyreek Stevenson, and the green Miles Murphy. That was the Miles Murphy pack. Last two packs, I think we're looking for one more green and obviously a kaboom or an autograph would be really cool to pull out of here. All right, there's our last green. See, now I'm smart. That is our last green there. Yes. Okay, now I'm getting it. 
takes me a little bit. Takes me like, you know, 12 packs to figure it out. Tank Bigsby, Jake Moody, Devin Witherspoon, Michael Pittman Jr. on the green. And is this a introductions? Okay. Introductions. But this one seems, this one seems a little bit different. It's also Tank Dell, which is nice. For those that were thinking I was throwing slander on the Tank Dell the other um, the other day in one of those videos where I was really excited to maybe pull a Stroud and then it was Tank Dell and I sounded upset. The only reason I'm upset is because I'm trying to get a silver Stroud. I think Tank Dell is great, but I was trying to get a silver Stroud. So uh, I love Tank Dell. No, no disrespect to Tank Dell. Okay, no, these are the same cards. Okay, so they are just shiny. Last pack, folks. If you made it this far, hashtag Tadpole Gang for life. Appreciate you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. That really helps a lot. If you're enjoying the content, obviously make sure that you drop a like on the video. Let us know how we're doing, what packs you want to see us open maybe in the future. If you guys like the new light setup, let me know. And uh, make sure you subscribe. We've got a lot of content, a lot of content coming. And I think we're going out with a rock out here. I think we're going out with a rock out. Brock Purdy. I love keeping Brock Purdy's. Jordan Love. CD. Kamara. Ooh. Another Anthony, Anthony Richardson. All right. Two of them. Let's get one more Stroud. Ooh. We'll take a Rasheed Rice, though. Okay. And a rock out. Kid reporter on the back. Rock out is going to be Jordan Addison. Ooh. Randy Moss. Did not see that coming. To be honest, he is someone that used to rock out a lot, though. He would have some of the best celebrations. I don't know if that's what that card implies, is like people that have good celebrations. But he would have some pretty good celebrations. All right. So let's show you guys some of the highlights from Three Blasters, what we got here. And this is, again, this is a Kaboom or Bust product. I think for the hobby box and also for the blasters, there's not too much. I mean, you can look over here. This is the base that we got. And then these are all the rookies and inserts. So, I mean, you're, you know, more than half the cards you're getting are base cards, but um, you know, you can still pull some nice cards. And I, I love the look of this. We got Anthony Richardson, Rasheed Rice, Randy Moss on the rock out, Tank Dell on the introductions. Jordan Addison on the by Storm. Puka base, another Rasheed Rice base. We have Travis Kelsey on the green parallel. Dalton Kincaid by Storm, another Puka base. And then Anthony Richardson. And then our best card is going to be the CJ Stroud. We only got one of them, but we got the CJ Stroud on the green. All right, well, that's going to do it, guys. Again, thank you so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Keep ripping them packs.